Welcome back, Emma <laughs> County Susie. We've got Austin Ford and John Green and a couple of banjos. You betcha. Hi, guys. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Not quite yet, but maybe this afternoon. And we were talking about different kinds of style in your bluegrass and John, your jazz? Jazz and, and Dixieland. I like, know. oh, I love Dixieland yeah. Yeah, music. Dixieland. Oh, you said toe tapping. That's toe tapping we, music. We play a lot of the old 20s and 30s and 40s music. Oh, that's great. That gets all 10 of them just going <laughs> yeah. like crazy. Awesome. Most times, you know, sometimes at one point, a lot of these instruments were three strings. Mm -hmm. And at some point, a fourth string got added, and it, that went into its own genre of music. Okay, John is kind of there. It's very classic. And they added a fifth string. This is more the hill music, the Appalachian sound and bluegrass and all that, uh -huh. or the frailing and claw hammer, like that. Come to this festival. They're all going to be there. Tell us about fact. that. Yes. June 14th. June 14th, yeah, well, Mary Ann McCammon owns the Imperial Hotel down there, and we're in the Rotary Club in Plymouth together, and she said, this is this guy that walks around playing banjo. What do you think if we got a whole bunch of banjos? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so one thing led to another. I said, I know John Green, and that's, a, that's where we'll start. So uh, we've got uh, John's uh, wire to a Sacramento banjo band. and Wineland uh, banjo band. Uh, Wineland banjo used band. used to play with the Oakland band, played with the Oakland band wow. for many years. And that's great. And then we've got the uh, Banjo Racketeers coming from San Francisco. And you've got a lot That's of people, a lot of people backing you. You got a. a, a yeah. I hope, oh, the sponsors. Yeah. yeah. Uh, do we take Merzlach signs off of there? No. We yeah. Don't. I, I, don't don't we include him in anything. <laughs> 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 oh, we got to, actually Rick Sanders. He at our home. He kicked in some money for this. And who else we got in there? We got uh, Debbie Bellotti from Bank of America. Yeah. We've Came got uh, Logan Vineyards. We've got Nicholson Music, Rory's Towing, Plymouth uh, Foothills Rotary. You've got uh, Collision Centers, the Feed Stimus, Farm, collision, yeah, yeah Stimus, Stimus, Auto yeah, Body, good, Tommy's yeah. Cafe, Up Cool Country, Wells Fargo, Plymouth um, yeah. Branch. So yeah. you've got all kinds and Merzalak signs. <laughs> what don't you sponsor? <laughs> yeah, Myself. I, I, actually, Cammy's yeah. going to be printing that list there. That's kind right, of, I, I am going to be making some signs so you can put out and recognize yeah. your sponsors. You guys going to play for us today? Please. Well, we'll try something. I don't know, John. He's chosen like bluegrass number. I got to tell you, I'm the hacker next to this guy. But <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll try to keep up. Now, am, okay. I, am I in your way, John? No. Do you want me to move? No, I'm not. All right. All right. Let me hear you. She bought some perfume and it's filled with a glorious woo-hoo! But much to her surprise at the heaven of lies was nothing but good old Mountain Dew. Well, they called it that good old Mountain Dew. And them that refused it a few. A shop of mug if you fill up a jug with a good old Mountain Dew. Woo! Yay! <laughs> I told you, you can't, you, you can't, you can't sit, sit down. Are, are we still in the air? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yes, we it's are. Great. Yes, we are. You'll hear that yeah. style. Uh, we've got one fellow, actually from Sutter Creek, he's going to do a workshop in the morning at 10 o'clock, right? And he'll be teaching the Scruggs style or the picking style here. Then we got uh, Rick Sims, from, that's Jonathan Lack, and then Rick Sims in the afternoon at 2, I think, and he'll be uh, teaching the client. He was one of the yes. top... Uh, that Guys now, John, wasn't Earl Scruggs one of those famous... Uh, Earl Scruggs was a five-string right. player. Five-string, okay. He invented right. this style, right. basically. Yeah. yeah. Right. yeah. Eddie, Eddie Peabody played the kind of music that I do. Okay. 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 Can we hear a jazz number from you? Uh, sure, yeah. Yeah, let's hear some. Good key in there, bro.
That's beautiful. Boy, John, I, that is gorgeous. That's I would think that <clears throat> that was hard to do. That was beautiful. John will be doing a workshop in the afternoon to teach you that style. Okay, to cover that, that, that style, sort of an advanced uh, class on it. We'll have a fellow at uh, 10 in the morning. We'll do an introductory workshop. Great. For, for like this style we have banjo. two ladies and a guy. We do. We have two ladies morning, and a guy. And they will have banjos to loan for someone who wants to, to start off on four-string banjo. Tenors and plectrums. Now, June the 14th, it's on Saturday, down yes. in Amador City. What time are you going to be there and start? We're guessing folks are going to roll in. They're banjo players, so you never know, but they're rolling. in. Sign up Can they tell time? Nine o'clock. Probably nine. Go to the hotel and sign in, yeah. right? And the workshop will start at ten. Jams anytime, anywhere. You know, Great. Jam sessions, mm -hmm. and then John's uh, band will uh, perform at eleven. Is that the Wineland or is that the that's it, Sacramento? Band. That's the Sacramento band. And then the Wineland right. will be performing it too. Now let me ask you a question. What is your most favorite favorite tune to play on the banjo? John? I just played mine. Uh, <laughs> autumn leaves? Yeah. It's beautiful. Austin? That's Darling Corey. That's, that's probably my favorite. <laughs> I was a, a fan of Ricky Skaggs. I believe he had some banjo and some of his, I believe Highway 40 Blues has a, yeah. has a banjo solo in part of it. Yeah. They at do home, a little bit of everything. At home when I practice, I <coughs> throw in a lot of old religious songs. Oh, you know. there's nothing mm. better on the banjo. Yeah. One of one of my favorites. Like closer there, walk, close, yeah, oh, and mm. closer walk with thee. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. beautiful. You want to play that? <coughs> you want to give us a little shot with that? Something like that. <laughs> Very good. So don't forget, get down there and enjoy these gentlemen. Is there any admission cost to get in? No, absolutely not. You show up in Amateur City, you know, it's not too hard to find. There's only one road that goes through, you know. <laughs> yeah. And then you'll see some tables set up. Uh, John mentioned one fellow going to have a lot of parts. Uh, Paul uh, Rimmel from Nicholson Music is sending a couple of guys. Uh, Rick Sims is probably the claw hammer style banjo player in the, in the whole area. Great. And another fellow's a luthier. <laughs> Somebody that makes them, right? And he's going to have a table set up with a whole bunch of parts, and he'll show you how to make them, or you can buy parts. And, and we'll have one little. fellow there selling his books. Don't yeah. shoot the, ba yep. the banjo player. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Most people are tempted, but. <laughs> no, I think it's great music. It just it. Uh, are you going to come? I'm going to try. Yeah, there you absolutely. Go. Right. You know, it's Forward. what's what's really fo what's really funny is that if even if you're in like a you know, kind of sad or whatever, you get that music as well like him and you get up and start dancing and carry on. Yeah. Get on, yeah. It's happy, happy music. It sure. is. Yeah, it's, right. it's, it's very right. happy music. Yeah, yeah. It's it's yeah. wonderful. So you wanna play us out to a commercial? Anything. Huh? Banjo show coming to the uh, Amateur City June 14th. Come down and see these guys. See a bunch of people. Thanks, for Thanks. Thanks for coming. Thanks, John. We're going to run to an ad break back with the closing of Friday's AM Live. Stay tuned. You're watching Amador County's local television network, TSPN.